Welcome to another edition of the Part-Time Preppers. Some miscellaneous silver pickups and a birthday present. So let's take a look here. Let's, hey, this is actually one of my birthday presents from the hand model. I do not care. So there it is. I am having some coffee while we do this. So let me take my coffee back. There's a slushy. That's for dessert in the background, but let's get to it. Uh, we'll start. Let's start with the local coin dealer. Okay. Uh, yes, the Cull Morgan dollars doing another tube, and there's a 1904, and it's pretty cool. But again, I took the pick of the litter because I don't know if you're going to see it. It's an S yeah, underneath there above the D and the O. It is an S mint mark now. It's pretty cool, pretty rough. But I like getting those rarer, slightly rarer dates. If you ever go to sell them, they, you may get a tiny bit of premium. So for 18 bucks, there it is. I took the pick of the litter again. So there's one. And went to a uh, farmer's market that we go to, hometown Pennsylvania. And there was two coin dealers there this this, this time we went. To. Don't have any of the Republic medals rounds here. And uh, couldn't resist. It was 19 bucks. There you have it. So that was from little coin man there very old well i shouldn't say very old but he had to be about 80 and it was very enjoyable to talk to him uh, he had been in the business for many many years and he's retired and he does it part-time and he's doing something he loves in retirement so god bless him this was only eight bucks now uh, a, a little bit over spot yes 90 percent. it has some i don't know what you would call it discolorations and what have you on it almost like there was tape on it I'm going to throw this in the foreign coin bank. I know it's American, but it just has that foreign. We have a few of them. 1893 Colombian Exposition, half dollar. But that's what I was thinking when I got it. It would look good in that foreign coin bank. And speaking of the foreign coin bank, local coin dealer. Yeah, she didn't have much foreign coins, but I do not or we do not have any of these. Uh, at least these type of silver francs, uh, 1933. There, oh, that looks pretty nice. I like her. She's looking good there. And uh, I like the strange silver content. I believe this is 68%. And, um, you know, that's kind of odd. Usually it's 90%, 92.5, 75. A lot of British, 50%. 68. It's kind of strange silver content on that one. Now to a birthday present. Yes, I've grown another year closer to having total control over my IRA with no penalties. <laughs> That's how I look at it, not to get depressed. And there it is. This was a Bay Precious Metals uh, special. Let's, let's get down and look at this, see if I can focus it. I left, I don't have a holder for it. 2017 10th ounce American Silver Eagle. There she blows. And that was from the hand model. And that was a decent deal at Bay Precious Metals. Uh, hard to see. I leave, leave it in the plastic till I get a capsule, but um, that was along with that mug and a couple of little presents from the hand model. I thank you for a birthday present. And uh, this brings us closer to our goal, goal uh, for 2017. We're at 0.8 ounce. Our goal uh, was 1.1 ounces for 2017. So uh, we're getting ever so closer. We're definitely on track. Now, mint. A lot of people aren't too thrilled with the U.S. mint. And I did a, a free uh, shipping from the mint uh, oh, video. Let's throw that up there. And uh, yes, we got a proof set. So I'm going to pause this. Excuse me. Going to pause this. And we're going to open her up and see what kind of quality control, what kind of proof set we got. Okay, we're back. Well, okay, this was all the packing in that box. It was one piece of paper. So there you go with the paper there. And this is exactly how I pulled it out of the box. Okay. Oh, partially open. Now, that was pretty good. That's a good sign. So let's open her up here and look at the 2017 proof set. Uh, I know some of these are not as popular. Let's put it right there. And uh, let's take a look here. Let's. This is what counts. Let's take a look at the silver quarters. Uh well, first glance, they're looking pretty good. Everybody's right side up. That's a good sign. And I'm looking over the camera here so I can really see. 
and I don't see any major problems yet. Let's take a look at old George. Okay. There's a little mark in between the two. I don't know if that's, I guess that's on the plastic. If you could see it, I don't know, almost, I don't know what kind of mark it is, but it's not on the coin, that's what counts, just in the plastic. And there's George, and I'm looking over the camera again, and George's all look pretty good. Let's flip it over one more time, and there they are. I cannot collect all the ATVs. Uh, I missed out the first year or two, then they went skyrocketing up, and uh, we do have many ATVs, or at least uh, well over a dozen, but at least we're going to try to get all the silver quarters, uh, America the Beautiful Quarter, so there's that, and let's take a look at these. Okay, again, I'm looking over the camera. I actually want to see uh, Kennedy. That's good. He just got a little, little dust on him there. Um, oh, the Lincoln looks good. Sacagawea is looking good. A little smile on her face. Let's flip her over. Okay. Okay, they're all looking good. So the uh, coins themselves look to be in nice shape. There you go. I'll have to put that proof set away. And that's, of course, your certificate of authenticity from the Mint. There you have that. And you could read it if you wish. There you have it there. And, uh, yeah, in a video or two from now, I'm going to hopefully, or it might take a month, I'll show you why we got this proof set. There's a little story behind it. and uh, But we'll have to wait on that. So that's just our meager pickups and a very nice birthday present from the hand model. Yes, there she is. In fact, it looks like the hand model a little bit. And there's that, there's that, there's that. And you know what? We're going to, for a little fun, we got the CCT coin slide, the famous CCT, one of a kind slide. And we're going to put this 68% uh, Frenchie down it. We'll see what kind of ride she takes. So let me lift this up a little bit, bring it back and... A little drum roll. We'll see how she slides. Oh, I think she passed the test. Until next time. Here, have a slip of sir slurpee. Oh, it's a candle. Until the next time, take care. Be good. Keep stacking from the part-time preppers. Thanks for watching.